Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the beginning of a few day vlog. It is for sure gonna be at least two days, potentially three. So it is Friday morning. It is about 7.45 right now. And just wrapping up, getting ready. So I have a big day. I've got some, I've got some pre-scheduled meetings I've got to do. And then, um, but pretty smooth work day overall. I feel very prepared for everything that I need to do today. And then this, afternoon after work I have my last appointment at Sev laser hair removal so uh, I mean I don't know it's my like last last ever but I bought a package and this is the last one in the package so I had initially bought a package I think it's like six sessions and then I paid for a couple individual sessions and then I purchased a second package uh, I thought after one package I was gonna be done. So that's why I just got a few individuals and then I was like, okay, we are nowhere near done. There's actually gonna be a lot more sessions needed. So then I bought the second. So this is the last one. And then um, I will be coming back, picking up the pups and driving us to Darren's parents' house because tomorrow is my sister-in-law's bridal shower. So, or no, baby shower. She's pregnant with their second, and I'm very excited for her. It's a little girl, yay. We need more girls in the family. So um, we are going to be going and helping her prep tonight, and then set up tomorrow. Um, I'm looking forward to that because I love events. I love planning events. I love like preparing for events, setting up events. I live for it. The theme is tea party, high tea high tea. So um, they're gonna be all like the sandwiches and like, you know, obviously tea and little finger foods and all of that. So I believe we are prepping a lot of that today. And then I was told that tomorrow I'm in charge of the charcuterie and I am the charcuterie queen. I am the reigning charcuterie queen. I mean, maybe not in the world, but like in the circles I run in, I am the charcuterie queen. And so I was very honored that she recognized that. Um, other things, yesterday I painted my nails. So uh, very happy with this color. It's an Essie color. And then um, I redid my toes because, oh, so basically my toes are pretty much this color. I had gotten them done at the salon, but they basically match. And so I did my hands to match my toes. And then I was like, my toes could actually be redone. So then I ended up redoing my toes. So now everything like matches, matches. Um, I made a vanilla latte this morning. Loving it. And I gotta finish getting ready because I gotta hit the road. So you guys, why did I act like I was about to have a really serious talk with you? <laughs> guys, listen, we need to talk. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take off here and i will see you guys after work and yeah that's it welcome back to the vlog guys if you haven't already don't forget subscribe um if you've made it this far um this is once again what is it with my long intros i can never shorten it <sighs> okay i will work on that i promise but if you made it this far clearly you are enjoying listening to me rant so please give it a thumbs up i would love that and i will see you guys after work Hey guys, it is hours later and I just got to my laser appointment. I'm in the car, it's right back there. And I wanted to pop in and just share with you guys, document the final appointment. Well, I don't wanna say the final appointment and it turns out that like I need more after this, but we are crossing our fingers that this is indeed the final appointment. I would love to be done. Okay. Here we go, the last time. I'm out, you guys, it was great. So I definitely like, I could feel it happening. You know, I every time I go in, I go up um, on like the, um, 
I don't know, like strength or intensity of it or like however, I don't really know what it's called, but like whatever that is, I go like one level higher. So I feel, I, I could like feel it happening, which tells me that there are less and less like thick hairs left and that it's working. I mean, obviously I can see the results in the fact that I don't have to shave as often, it's not growing as quickly. So anyway, feeling great. When I was checking out, they were like, are you ready to schedule your next appointment? And I was like, no, I think I'm done. And she, they were like, oh. and I was like, thank you, thank you. I know, I know, I did it, I did it, guys. Two separate car accidents just happened like simultaneously. Like, I, there are one, two, three, four, five lanes on the freeway I'm on right now. And the two left lanes and the two right lanes both just got in car accidents at the same time and my lane just like cruised on past it as like they're occurring that was crazy oh my gosh that was adrenaline rush like ah i'm like i feel like i'm ready to run a mile <laughs> it was like crazy so i'm back home to pick up the puppies to pick up the babies yeah wow Wow. Wow, guys. Wow, guys. <laughs> so I have everything all ready to go right here. Got my bag packed, uh, the gift, all the cake stands, and the different outfits. So we've got all that. Going to load up the car, and uh, I will see you guys at Darren's parents' house. We made it. We're here unpacking everything and waiting for everyone to get home because I guess everyone went out to run some errands. So just gonna, ooh, lighting's harsh. Finish unpacking. I just came in the kitchen and I saw this bag of ruffles and I was like, oh, sour cream and onion ruffles. I haven't had those in forever. Um, I took a bite and was like, what the heck is this? Lime and jalapeno. Since when? since when and I mean they even are like have like the seasoning that looks like sour cream and onion like do you see that like kind of like you can kind of see it better on that side but yeah like I'm kind of hungry so I'm gonna eat them anyway <laughs> So I told you guys it was tea party themed. So I guess because not all the trees are in bloom, they bought fake flowers and are going to make it look like the trees are in bloom. And then with these cute little umbrellas, we have teapots and cute little um, teacups and everything. And then we're gonna have all the tiered trays with um, different finger foods and sandwiches and the little flutes of champagne because apparently you drink champagne with tea According to Google at least so this is going to be so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited Okay, so we are getting close to What the tables are going to look like we are going to try swapping out these floral doilies for plain white ones and we are still of course working with the flowers and the different vases and all of that stuff so right now i'm just laying out all of the plates until we solidify which doilies we are going with um this is kind of all we can do and we're, we're figuring everything out but that's why we are starting today so that everything is perfect for tomorrow look how amazing this baby shower is coming together guys every single detail so here we've already set out the doilies and the little teacups. We have mixed teacups. So every single one is different. And this is the most put together table so far. And just look at this. So we have a floral doily at the bottom and then this one so that it just peeps through. And it ties in all of the beautiful floral teacups we didn't want too much pattern like this. We tried this out, but it was too much with some of the more floral teacups. So we have the white ones on top. And then look, 
we took the flowers and by we kaylee took the flowers out of the um container that it came in and put it in this flower pot look how incredible that looks and i guess all the doilies plates everything's from sheen including these little cake stand or not cake stand but these um tiered trays all sheen and she has little cute favors over here also i'm not sure if it's sheen or sheen or sheen but um they have everything and then just went to dollar tree to get mixed teacups and it looks absolutely stunning and where'd you guys get these cute little flower oh, amazon. spoons amazon and then look at these are so cute from hobby lobby look at little crowns and oh, then look at beautiful these. are these, these are so um cute. are these candle holders yeah candle holders table oh, holders that's gonna look be beautiful these. look at these like kind of iridescent oh my gosh wow aren't they pretty those are so, beautiful And then of course, electric or not electric, uh, like battery yes, operated. Yes, battery so we don't we don't and start any fires out here. Not wax, they're plastic, so they don't melt in the sun. So oh, marvelous! Them, you know, I'm gonna have to put something in there to kind of hold them. And then where is this gorgeous tablecloth from? Amazon. Amazon. Yep. All right. Next question. Where is this gorgeous? Um, World Market. World Market. And I have to tell you. Let me just show you. So are these breakfast at Tiffany ones. <gasps> and the new thing at World Market, mm -hmm. is you actually buy at the undercarriage and you pop off the top, you can interchange. Darren and I, your hubby and I actually changed out umbrellas today. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It took us like five minutes. So you can mix, you can like change your umbrella. Like. I would be doing that it's for every everything. event. It would, it's enabling, it which is a problem. No, we got three. <laughs> Dad and I bought three different umbrellas. We have these, we have those, and then we have some that are full macrame. They look like lace. Oh my gosh. You're getting real excited. I'm getting excited. And then we have these chair covers that are going to be going over all the chairs, of course, so that it all fits the vibe. And then the trees were not in bloom. Darren, so this incredible Darren, elf of ours, <laughs> he got on a ladder. They went to Hobby Lobby and picked up all these flowers. So these are fakes of the type of flower that this tree actually is. I think it's magnolia. Um, I think that's what it's called, but they didn't have enough. So then they also got peonies. And so they just went, or he went every other tree to make it look like the tree is in bloom. So um, it all looks absolutely incredible. And we are still setting things up over at these two tables. And then we have this gorgeous fountain in the background. And I don't know if you can hear it right now, but just the sound of the trickling water just it goes throughout the yard and you can hear it while you're here we're gonna be playing classical music and what we were talking about is we were playing like this like really great like class not like beethoven classical like i'm not even sure if it's called classical but like kind of more like instrumental kind of classical vibe music but we were saying we want to look up if bridgerton has a playlist because if bridgerton has a playlist we want to play that because it's like modern day songs and like artists and such but then they make it like classical vibe so we're gonna look into that very excited tbd but we are so excited about this i feel like it just keeps getting more extravagant i just brought the cake stands i showed up and i feel like they just keep bringing more things out that we're adding to it so i'll keep you guys posted but this is becoming more elaborate and more gorgeous by the minute and it just makes me want to throw a tea party so i'm throwing a tea party soon don't know what it's for but i'm inspired so it's, invited, it's gonna happen um not only are you invited you are now co-host or okay. like yes. co-event planner yes. because you made yes. this happen and I mean, I'm just helping set up, but she's the one that sourced, her and Kaylee sourced everything and came up with this vision. So I'm happy to be a part of this, but um, yeah, I'm inspired. I want to do my own immediately. <laughs>
given us for mood music. And we're wishing we were having an evening tea party. We should be having an evening tea. Isn't it beautiful here? The candle light. Stunning. Okay, so ignore the presence of sprinklers. They are not going into the event area. So I am so impressed with this lighting. It is 9.30 p.m. and it's not this bright out here. But look how beautiful it is. So now we've added all of the chair covers and we've started to add the flowers. Well, you guys saw that this, uh, this table with all of these flowers. So now we need to add flowers to all the other teapots. So you can kind of see we have queued up the teapots. We have all the candles going so we can see what the vibe is like. And now everything has, or all the settings have like their little favors and the cute little napkins. We decided to add the utensils with the napkins. Moving on to the next phase of the evening, we are going to be building charcuterie cups and prepping some of the sandwiches. So um, I got out the things that were very obviously like meant for this, but I am still waiting to see um, what else they're gonna bring out because I'm just trying to get started here. So right now I'm taking all of the individual little mozzarella balls out of the packages and just getting everything started. So when everyone else is ready to move on to this step, everything's ready. So there's now a whole group of us working on this and they're all coming in to help with this right now. So I'm probably not gonna vlog this part. I'll try to show you guys when things are done, but otherwise I will see you guys in the morning. I hope you guys are enjoying this video because I am so enjoying giving you guys this content because I am, today's like the best day ever. I love events, I love baby showers, and yeah, I'm just on cloud nine right now. So I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. It's supposed to be a beautiful baby shower. Look at this disaster. <laughs> but, but look okay, at the but product. look at the beauty. You would never know that this beautiful. came out of the, this uh, situation. <laughs> yeah, we'll just ignore everything else. <laughs> it's 1.26 a.m. The bacon for the BLTs just came out and we just finished prepping most of the sandwiches and most of the charcuterie. We have a bunch of the stuff ready to go in the fridge in like Tupperware and in the drawers and stuff. We have other things prepped over here, like all the beginnings of the charcuterie cups with all the nuts and everything. We have those all prepped, so that hopefully will be quick assembly. So, oh, we're making progress, guys.
morning, it's the next day and it's Father's Day. So last night after the event, we hung out by the pool and then we grilled up burgers and then we cleaned everything and just really hung out. It was a good time. So now it's the next morning, it's Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all of you people and animal dads and dags, dads out there. Hope you're having a great day. We are getting ready to go boating. So I'm just, why am I doing my hair? Um, I don't know, I just felt like it didn't, it just didn't look very attractive. I know it's gonna last literally like eight minutes, but um, that's fine. <laughs> I was trying to not curl every piece, just add a little bit of texture. However, I keep feeling like at this point I've curled everything but like a few things or a few areas. So I'm slowly ending up curling everything. See, like that just sticks out like a sore thumb. Okay, so we're, <laughs> we're curling everything. That's, uh, that's what we're doing now. about 6 30 we just got back from boating finished unloading the boat putting everything away to make sure that they wouldn't have to do everything alone once we left but now we are getting ready to head out so we just finished packing everything up and we're getting ready to load up the car and head home so i am gonna go ahead and end the video here i feel like we've had a lot of fun content i don't know how long the video was but i think it's enough also can we note my face versus my shoulders okay I use super goop sunscreen every day and so like my face like never tans and then my arms are just I mean they're a different look they're like a different tone than every other part of my body so we have like so many different skin shades going on I don't even know what's happening oh my gosh I just noticed that as I was like looking at the camera but anyway thank you guys again so much for watching if you haven't already don't forget to subscribe below give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to tune in next week for another new video I am so happy that I'm back into the routine of like uploading every week and recording for you guys I'm having such a good time and I hope that you guys are enjoying watching the videos so thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next one bye guys mm -hmm.